This looked very appealing. It looked like it had the backing of the Arizona State University. It promised to be intense training, an advanced course taught over at ASU. But some who paid hundreds to go now say they were misled, and there are similar complaints nationwide. Tonight, ABC 15 investigator Joe Ducey with an unusual story, complaints about a business holding fake seminars. It's a Thursday in Cave Creek, and Foothills Caring Corps volunteers are delivering food, transporting seniors. Helping them to remain independent in their own homes. It's a bad economy, so securing new grant money is crucial for any nonprofit. Director Deborah Dieterman liked what she saw with an advanced grant writing seminar offered by the North American Planning and Policy Academy, or NAPA. So each of our grant proposals are really uh, finely tuned. Intense, strategic, results based. The course was advertised as being taught right at ASU. Very bold letters that said Arizona State University West. That university connection is one reason Carol Humble of Goodyear agreed to teach it. But ASU tells the ABC 15 investigators it never had a connection with Napa. At the last minute, the night before, the course was moved to this Phoenix hotel where both women showed up and felt duped. It was generic information that anybody could get off the internet. Deborah says what happened in these conference rooms was basic and confusing. The materials poorly written. There's nothing that I've used from that book. And the online portion? didn't happen. We're told Napa wouldn't even pay the hotel's internet hookup fee. I was amazed that it was so disorganized. Carol called Napa materials a mishmash and instead relied on her own grant expertise to teach the course. In my opinion, this class probably wasn't be worth more than ten dollars. Yet seven Valley nonprofits strapped for cash enrolled at about four hundred dollars each and the ABC 15 investigators found Napa has been busy around the country from Harvard to the University of Miami to Seattle we counted 21 courses scheduled by Napa since March they target law students academics nonprofits and the fee was up to six hundred dollars per person and online complaints followed. Poorly prepared and woefully underqualified. Six hours the first day, one and a half the next, a total waste. We walked out after no instruction. Each complaint comes from a different city. Hi, this is Joe Ducey with ABC 15 in Phoenix, and I've called uh, numerous times before. Napa didn't return our calls or emails. Their website listing is privately registered. It offered very few details on any expertise or credentials. And we found the address they list is actually a Los Angeles UPS store mailbox. They would send a check within seven days of the end of the class. Weeks later, Carol hadn't been paid for teaching. Well, after our involvement and after Carol's constant pushing, Carol finally got her money. Deborah says she did learn from Carol's teaching, but warns others she got nothing from Napa. Nonprofits really don't have the money nor the time to spend working, going to classes that really are not what they say they are. Despite complaints filed, the Arizona and California attorneys general have not taken action. Meanwhile, Napa has more seminars planned. Their website shows 20 courses scheduled around the country for just the next couple of months. I'm investigator Joe Ducey, ABC 15 News.